Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through different shapes and colors guys. So basically whatever signs which we are seeing on the roads, there is a huge meaning for each and every sign, its shape and its color also guys. Okay. So first let us go through the shapes then we will be moving on to the colors. Okay. Yes. So if you recall, I told you the octagon is only used for stop sign, right? Yes, that is the exact thing which is written here also. Similarly, circles. So circles are always used to show the mandatory signs or compulsory signs or regularity signs. Okay, yes. So regulation, sorry, regulation sign. So these could be, so the speed limit, okay. So it could be the speed limit as well as the no entry boards, no parking and all those things guys, okay. Yes. And the triangle which is a downside that is a nothing but with one end point downwards. This is only for giveaway guys. I think I told you that both of these and this can be used in uh, the warning sign. So no guys, sorry for that. Down arrow is used only for giveaway. Please remember that guys. Okay. And upper, uh, upper, tri upper triangle will be used for warning signs. So any kind of caution like uh, narrow bridges. Uh, turnings or sudden streets and all those things okay pedestrian walks and all those things okay whereas the rectangle it might be in vertical axis or in horizontal axis the rectangle it is just for storing the information sign sorry showing the information sign guys okay yes any kind of hotels any kind of telephones and all those things okay yes we are also having these kind of symbols also guys rectangle with the triangle so i think most of you saw this symbol when you are going into your villages or any kind of places right so whenever there is a city or any kind of a small place also the place a name will be written here and they will keep a arrow with kilometers right so if you recall you have somewhere observed them right yes so those are nothing but the rectangle with the triangle shapes these are used to flag the direction signs park and right signs okay yes similarly we see the road signs also so road these are nothing sorry not road diamond signs so diamond signs are for warning or alerts guys okay yes so any kind of animal crossings or any kind of work zones school zones all those things you'll be showing on this okay yes so now i hope everyone got some basic idea about the shapes right yes so now let us move on to colors okay so red color okay red color is used for the stop sign and no entry so it is used only for two reasons so that is nothing but stop sign and no entry it is used for a most circular border so basically whenever you see any sign it is encoded with the red color guys i think most of you saw that also right yes if you want i can show you an example just to give me a second if there is an example i can show you okay. so see here guys okay see here it is encoded with the red color in that way okay yes so you got an idea right yes so that's what i was trying to say so it will be encoded with an with, a, with the, in, in the circle and the thickness is a 70 mm okay okay similarly white color okay so it is used for restriction end and giveaway signs okay it is a background colors are most prohibitedly circular circular signs so basically for any circular sign even now i showed for the speed right so even in the speed also we used red as a strip and white as a background right yes similarly background color for all triangular questions are also used okay yes so these are some more uses you can say guys similarly yellow so yellow orange green and these colors are a bit rare you can say okay so la L, sorry yellow is used background color for specific warnings and body color of a poles so basically the poles which you will be observing though those are strapped between yellow and black if you recall right yes so most of the situations you can say okay so it is used in that way similarly orange i think i never saw orange color okay 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 i saw sir the road numbers will be given right yes so use it to party yes exactly yes so basically whenever you go to nh65 or any highway it will they will be showing some boards right yes i don't know exactly which shape they used to be but they will be written nh35 nh65 like that even for green also the same situation green and orange both are used for the same reason guys okay route marking and signs and most of the directions okay yes similarly we are also having blue color okay so used as a background color for circular compulsory speed direction control so even in this direction also blue color has been used right here yes exactly okay i think that paper is used a lot guys right yes similarly brown okay okay so used as a background for asian highway routes 
and tourist routes okay so i never saw it similarly black black is used for text and all those things right yes similarly fluorescent yellow green okay so these are used for information science guys if you recall you can remember them fluorescent yellow okay similarly fluorescent orange so these all are the used okay similarly the lettering so lettering will be in uh, the numbers or the text it will always be in a minimum size case so that anyone can view from the from his vehicle only similarly symbols symbols are nothing but those are the common symbols which anyone can represent can identify okay yes so i hope everyone got some basic idea about this color and shape concept so in the next lecture sorry in the next lecture we'll be discussing about a traffic control devices guys sorry we'll be discussing about the road markings right so we already discussed about them those are nothing but three types now we are done with the road signs so now we will be moving on to the road markings okay yes so let us meet in the next lecture thank you thanks for watching